Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to even more Castlevania Lords of Shadow. Let's open the epic fairy tale book. If I sound a bit slightly weird, I just came back from the dentist. Um, so that's, that explains why. Chapter 1. I guess we're, this is all chapter 1. I have to, I'll have to rename those YouTube videos. I guess I'll do it. Ah, okay, whatever. The Dead Ball. Alone again with only his thoughts as company. He continues on his journey to find the one he seeks. Who or what was that strange creature? There is a power here that few know, a power that could have some influence on events. Perhaps the Guardian of the Lake is aware of him now and offers aid in his quest. There is just the small matter of the dead bog to overcome, a place that has claimed the lives of many of the Brotherhood. The smell of death is strong here, and danger lies around every corner, but nothing will stop him. Nothing will stand in his way. What ill news do you have? Oh, it's a, it's a life gem. Click five to increase your max health. What do you have? A scroll. There's something in the water. Something... Dot, dot, dot. Terrible. I've seen men dragged under, never to return. The location of these creatures can only be seen as ripples or bubbles on the surface. I surmise one must wait for these ripples and bubbles to disappear before progressing through the bog. One cannot walk around them because noxious fumes lay lay either side of the safe path, so one must be patient and wait for the right moment to cross over them. Heck, I know that I'm going to die, but at least we'll be fighting, not swallowed by any of those mire fiends. Uh. <coughs> Climb upwards by jumping towards it. No, a grenade. Ha! That was actually kind of funny. Pick it up before it explodes. Okay. Kaboom! Come here. Oops. Oh, that's those things the knight was talking about. Okay, so the green is poison. Unlock the character entry, the Naiad. A large part of the danger of the swamps lies in the hands of creatures known as Naiads. These living things are, un are usually passive, lying inconspicuously on ri riverbeds and in muddy, damp places, waiting until someone stumbles within range. When they attack, their unfortunate victims usually mistake their limbs for branches and are soon drowned and eaten. In days gone by, these once beautiful creatures were worshipped and sacrifices were made to them. But they are now forgotten by humans and have become evil predators, plaguing both wandering man and beast alike. Is there anything over here? I can grab. No. Okay. Let's 
Wait. Okay, go. Some some foul beast is watching me. Okay, there's a health fountain over there, which I don't think I need. Yeah, I only have a little bit of health lost. So let's go this way. Very eerie and quiet so far, aside from those initial goblins, or whatever they were. I'm just going to call them goblins. Four goblins! Where's your grenade? Come here. Whoa! Not cool. I might just go back for that health now. Oh no! Get off me! Probably not necessary, but I really don't feel like dying. Besides, I might find something, who knows? Or I could just find more goblins. Is that really it? Okay. Wait for these sea monsters here to disappear. Another health fountain. Checkpoint. Must be doing something right. Let's go to the right first. Let's see what's over here. This dastardly swamp. No, Gabriel, get on, get up, get on the there. There's a knight over there. 
lots of monsters here. What treasure do you have? A life gem. Good. Glad I came here. Oh, doesn't look like you're going anywhere. I'll just go around you, stupid monster. There's a lot of them down here. That's okay, because they're dumb. Checkpoint. I think I've been here already. Frog. Pick up the grenade back press. Yeah, I know this already. Oh, I need to knock the tree over. I see. Come on, goblins. Thank you. There's a knight over here. There's a mausoleum here in the bog that has lain undisturbed for years. Cardinal Volpe informs me that the legendary artisan Ronaldo Gandalfi constructed a powerful relic there during his sojourn, which will aid the one that wields the combat cross. So me! That's... that's... What a coincidence! I must admit I am apprehensive, many of my comrades lie dead along the way, and I am wondering if this fool's errand will, be the, will not be the end of me too. Well, it looks like it was. Alright, let's go. Wading through the swamps of despair. Oh god. No! Get off! Get off! Like, it's probably faster to just let them grab me, because I don't think they're hurting my health. Unless I mess up the quick time event. I'm sinking in the mud. Get out before it's too late. That's okay, I'm right here. thing is still following me. Hello. Just you two? Silly goblins. Where'd they go? Ow! You bastard! It looks like the way to go. Ha! Thank you. It's 
locked. Damn it. That's okay. Forgive me, brother, but my need is far greater than yours. This relic was also built by the renowned artisan. The articulated metal tip can be used to grip objects and enemies from a distance. So now I'm Scorpion. Also allows me to swing around environments. Cool. I can grip these shining grip points. A troll! A swamp troll. They are rare subspecies of the larger cave troll, so this is a smaller version. Great. Although similar in appearance to their dry land cousins, the thick fur has been replaced with a slimy coating similar to wet mold, which better suits the damper weather of their habitat. They are ferocious in battle and display a cunning that belies their outward appearance. Whoa! Ow! That actually what? Away from me. Hit and run. Hit and run. Ah, he's dazed. Now why him to death? What is this? Now carry more daggers. Excellent. Silver daggers. They've been bound to be thrown with extraordinary precision. Made of silver and small bones of saints hidden in their grips. Both characteristics give this weapon its its destructive power against supernatural beings, especially those who are descendants of the lycanthrope Dark Lord. Ah. Uh. Ah, yes. I'll take that. Didn't really need it, but hey, I think we're about to start a new level soon. Not quite.
Oh no, come on. What was that? Ah. Whatever. Oh, now it works. Okay, that ledge is gonna fall soon. Yep. No, I don't want a grip yet. I wanna visit this guy. Ah, there's my health back. Platforming. Ah. Ah, almost like it didn't make it. Ah. Some temple. All right, part three is complete. The dead bog. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Have a good one.